Hello everybody. So now I want to talk about calculus. The topic today is about integration. So now I want to show you how to answer. The first thing to calculate about this one, we need to graph about y equals to number 1 and y equals to x squared. So the graph of this one that should be like this. y equals to x squared, the graph should be like this. y equals to number 1, the graph should be like this. Now, when we compare about the mass between y equals to x squared and y equals to number 1, so we can see that between we need to find the intersection between x square and number 1 so we have negative number 1 in here and positive number 1 to find this one we just put about x square equals to number 1 and that's why we have x equals to number 1 and x equals to negative number 1 now, on the question, we have mass. That means if we look carefully between this one and the life form S is richer than number 1, we see that S square is bigger than number 1. So the mass that is about this one, from negative number 1 to positive number 1, we see that the line in here is bigger than the value of Y equal to S square. So this one is bigger than S squared, so the mass between negative number 1 to positive number 1, that is about number 1. And this one, when S is smaller than negative number 1, this one is bigger than this one. So the mass, that is about Y equal to S squared. So in this situation, when we write the answer, there should be about the interaction for number 1 the s when s is smaller than number 1 or we can put negative number 1 we can put s between negative number 1 to positive number 1 and about the second one this one we change by s square that means the absolute value of s is richer than number 1. So for this one, that is in here and here. So we need to find the final answer. The interaction of number 1, that is about S, and I will put about C. This one, we have S to the power of 3 over 3, and I will put about C. And that is the final answer. This is the end. Thank you for watching.